Welcome back to my channel. I uh, hope everyone's been well and uh, enjoying the weather where you are. Because in the UK at the moment, it is absolutely boiling. You don't get that much in the UK. Uh, and you probably won't hear me say that a lot either. But um, it is absolutely roasting. I think it's up to about 33. Got to be around 33 um, degrees. It's just crazy. Absolute nuts. So, haven't been in the shop because it's just way too hot to get in the shop, but I do have a project video for you this Friday um, because I've uh, made a couple of videos uh, a few weeks ago, had a bit of time, and uh, did uh, quite a bit of time in the shop. So, we'll have a project video for you this Friday, so don't worry. So, um, I'm going to make this short. Yeah, he always says that, but I am. A couple of things, and uh, one of them is a quick update on Maker Central. You knew it was coming. Um, but I've got some really fantastic news for you and uh, I just wanted to let you know. So I've had a couple of confirmed makers that are coming over to uh, the UK for Makers Central. One of those is Make It With Dad. And uh, this guy is fantastic. I met him over in Atlanta. Um, you want to check his channel out, I'll leave a link below. And uh, he's a really nice chap and uh, makes some really cool things as well. So check his channel out. He is coming over from the US um, all the way to the UK for this event. So he's already got it cleared, sorted. Um, and there's a massive hornet in here flying around. And it actually looks like a bird. Look at the size of this hornet. Well, I'm glad he's gone. So I would definitely check him out. Um, he's coming over from the States, which is going to be which is really great news. I'm also really quite excited to announce my next maker who's coming to Makers Central. You may have seen some of her videos on YouTube. You may already be a subscriber. Uh, if you haven't seen her, then check out the link below. Um, but it gives me great pleasure to announce that uh, Laura Kampf is coming. So uh, Laura is, uh, I contacted Laura and uh, she um, confirmed last week that she would be coming on over to uh, Maker Central, which is absolutely fantastic news for us. And uh, as I say, if you haven't seen Laura's stuff, she makes some really cool things. I know she's just recently signed a deal with Triton Tools, uh, which is really great. So I think Triton now sponsor her. So I definitely think that we could also see Triton at the show as well. I will confirm a little bit later on uh, if Triton are going to attend, but I would say that they would do, considering Laura's coming. Still working on some other things, uh, other people coming and working on some other attractions. Now what we want to try to do is um, get some attractions for you guys to come and see as well. So it's not just coming to see YouTube makers um, and watching a few demos and things. There are gonna be some attractions there which is gonna be really exciting. So I'm gonna get some really great things going on for some kids and some families. You know, so it's a, it's a great weekend. It's a great day out for all of you. So um, I'm working on some really cool things as well. So um, bear with me. The sooner I know, the sooner I'll be announcing it on this channel for you. And so I wanna keep updating with you with more stuff that's going on. Once the website goes live, and I'm telling you, this website looks the biz. Really does look great. Um, and it's going to keep you updated so you can keep checking back um, so you won't necessarily need me waffling on to you about updates in the future because all the updates will already be online um, but uh, nevertheless I'll probably still tell you anyway but they'll all be updated online for the attractions that we're uh, getting there all the, and all the YouTube makers that we're getting there and all the sponsors and, and all the exhibitors as well so everyone's everything's going to be listed out it's going to be really cool Anyway, enough about Make Essential now because I know I don't want to bore you to death with it too much. Um, I had a bit of mail in and uh, this guy contacted me actually and said, oh, do you mind if I send you some of my um, bits of wood? Of course, you know, no problem at all. Fantastic. Pop it in the post. I'll have a look. And then this stuff turns up. Now, I've got a whole box full of this wood. Now, there's all sorts of colours in there. So, you've got blues pinks, purples, reds, loads of different colours. And they're like what laminated kind of like uh, laminated blanks, aren't they? 
uh, of some kind there, like uh, lots of wood, I think, just stuck together, I believe, isn't it? Um, is that right? I think they are. I think there's like loads of strips and strips of, um, of like wood, and they're all just glued together to make like a blank. Um, but I've got so many of them in here. Um, I've got round ones, um, which have already been sort of turned round. Um, I've got little tiny ones here as well that he sent me. So many things. Um, this is the guy's um, business at CWP. Now we'll put a link down for this uh, this guy, obviously. Um, and his name is Eric Fenton, um, and he's got a place um, out in the USA. And uh, he's a graphic designer, it says here, and laser laser engraver. But um, but yeah, they obviously do some really cool wood stuff. So um, it's going to be really quite exciting to to get this turned really so there's another guy here John Cannon is also one of the directors there as well have I missed anyone off no that's John and Eric so it looks like it's John and Eric so uh, I really appreciate that guys uh, for sending this all the way to the UK to little old me I mean that's just amazing you know I really appreciate that sort of stuff I mean you could send this type of stuff to anyone and you've chosen to send it to me and I really I really appreciate you that um, I'm gonna make something really cool with this now, um, <clears throat> there's loads of colours in this, and obviously, as you know, I love colours, so um, I think we can make something really cool. So we'll probably glue some of this together. Um, we might then make some kind of vase out of it. I think a vase, actually, would be quite nice, because I um, haven't really made a vase for a little while, but maybe we could glue it all up together like this, maybe four of them, um, like this. Um, and then we could, maybe a bit bigger than that, so we could have, like, another one there. Then there's a green one. Oh, this one's even bigger. This is thicker, this one. Um, something like that. And then we can maybe sort of like, maybe a bit more wider. Um, and we can make a really cool looking bars. I reckon that would be quite smart. So maybe mixed up with some resin as well. Guys, on the note of resin, I get still get loads and loads of um, emails and messages about the resin that I use. Um, it's always in the link below. Always. Every single just video that I make, it's in the description below. And if you haven't uh, seen it yet, it's just basically wwwresin 4 the number 4, art.com. Um, I'll put it on the screen as well, so you've probably already seen it. But it's always in the link below, but I'm still happy to tell you. But um, I know I still get loads of people saying, oh, you know, did you mind if, I, if you let me know where, the, where you get the resin from? But it's, it's in the description. But I suppose when some people are watching videos, they don't necessarily look in the description, but everything that I use, all my products, my tools, um, the companies I work with um, are always in the always linked below. And that's it. That is it. So this is definitely a short waffle. And I really do apologise for those of you that wanted me to waffle a bit more. Um, probably other people are thinking, yes, it was a quick one. That is it really for today. Uh, well, it's been so hot, as I say, I'm just like, I'm s totally, totally sweating under here. It's so warm. Um, I just don't, I've never experienced this kind of heat in the UK before, it's just ridiculous. We're not equipped for this type of heat, so we go and melt down. You know, we, we're, we're the type of um, breed in the UK that will always go, oh, we, we never get any sunshine, we always have to go abroad, you know, the weather in the England is rubbish. And then when the sun hits, we're all like, oh my God, it is just ridiculous. You know, I can't stand this heat, I can't sleep, I can't do nothing. <laughs> we just moan about it. Um, but to be fair to us is that, you know, most of our houses aren't really equipped to handle this kind of heat. So there's no air con in our, in our houses, not like you have in like probably a lot of other countries. So it's like an absolute oven I inside our rooms. And, you know, we're trying to go to sleep at night. We've got these fans that are blowing like warm air into our faces. And we're thinking, yeah, this, this will do. And all this warm air is coming in. And we're like, yeah, that's kind of just making it even worse. But, you know, but that's just what it's like. And it's been like this now for the last like four or five days. And apparently it's set to last until July sometime. That's what they say. But it is so sticky. But uh, I like it. I don't, you know, I don't mind. But it is very uncomfortable in a sense because, you know, not everyone's got a swimming pool they can just go and jump into, you know, and not everyone's got aircon, like I said. So, yeah, so, so we're just going to whinge a little bit about the weather at the moment, even though we'd love, even though when it's not here, we whinge about that as well.
Um, so thanks very much for joining me on the channel. Thanks very much to all my new subscribers. I know there's quite a few of you come over, so I really appreciate that. And I hope that you like what you see and you stick around. Um, if you do like what you see, then please like and comment below and share the video if you, if you uh, like it. I know a few of you like the fidget spinners that I made last week. So uh, thanks very much for that. That's been, you've been really kind uh, with all your comments. And I will put those two up on my website. Um, if you haven't seen that I've got a website, check the link below. There is a website with lots of different bits and pieces on there. Again, it's generally stuff that I make in here, but I might make a few stuff off camera and I might put up there some bowls and vases and pots and things. And every now and again, you'll see some pencil stuff go up. I will put the fidget spinners up. Um, as I say, they don't, one of them doesn't spin greatly. The other one spins all right. They're not perfect, but they're kind of cool. Um, they're a little bit different. So if you wanted them, I'll stick them up there. And uh, I've got some baby groups I'm gonna make as well soon. I've just got my 3D printer and um, I'm gonna be making a few more baby groups and, and sticking them up on the website if you're interested. I know a few people have asked for them really. Not something that I'm gonna to continue to make all the time. I'm just gonna run a couple and, and, and stick them up there if you wanted them. Well, that's it guys. Thanks very much for, for joining me on the channel. Um, I've, um, I've been a bit ill actually recently. I've had a um, bit of a cold and a sort of hay fever. I don't normally get hay fever, but I've, the pollen count's pretty high I think in the UK at the moment. And uh, a bit groggy, you know, and, and stuff, but, um, you know, headaches and everything else, the heat hasn't helped. <laughs> there we go again, I'm moaning about the heat. Um, but um, nevertheless, I'm getting back on track and um, all, all, all should be well. So uh, thanks very much, guys, for tuning in. If you haven't checked out the Makers Central website yet, it is only a landing page, mind. It's one page, but it just allows you to go on and check out a bit about what we're going to be doing and you could submit your entry. So if you wouldn't mind popping on over there, checking out Makers Central. It's an event we're gonna hold next May in, the, uh, in Birmingham at the NEC. But before then, I will see you all at UKIS, which is in Coventry next month. That's not far away, so look forward to seeing some of you up there. I know some of you are gonna be going to UKIS, so I'm gonna be there. More than likely both days, so I'll be milling around somewhere and uh, you'll uh, hopefully we can say hi. So uh, thanks very much guys for joining me on the channel and I'll see you on Friday uh, for a project video. Take care.